lot of stories out there to be told. But as I always said, well, as I decided just now, it ain't how many you tell, it's what you tell. Of course, gotta be careful what you tell people around here. You never know who's listening in. So I figured I'd stick with something safe, something I know. Something that everyone can relate to. You know, the whole childhood injury stories. Everyone's got a few. Best way to get to know someone isn't to go through life experiences with them, tell them who you are. It's to tell them you fell off the swings when you were five and ripped an arm tendon. Yeah, I got some childhood injury stories. So there was that one time with my toe. I was six when it happened. I know that because I remember thinking to myself when it happened, I was six. Anyway, you know how an injury can change everything so suddenly? One second I'm dancing around in my Batman pajamas, the next I knock a thick wooden chair right onto my toe. The nail swelled up and went black for about a week. Woke up one morning, it was gone. If there's any lesson you can learn from that, it's not to jump around playing Action Man when there's hard mahogany in the room. I must have been ten at the time of this one. Just minding my own in the bathroom like any other day. If you kids ask me now what advice I'd give you for the future, it'd be not to sneeze when there's a hard pointed cabinet right in front of your face. Bam! Right in the skull. Cracked right down the middle, right there. You can still hear the sounds clear as day. The sounds of... Looking back at the quirky little injuries of my past, of course, I hope I've learned from my mistakes. I hope I never end up with any more of these stories to add to this list. But you know, they've made me a wiser man. Made me a little more cautious of this cruel world. And of course, it's an excuse to hang around in skulky black and white bars from the 1940s. I just hope you learn from my little stories. You better take note of your injuries. Otherwise you will end up a broken man like me. I'll pass to you soon. Good luck out there, kid. Oh, oh. Watered down coke is not a good substitute for whiskey.